Hi there, it's James from Twinkle. Today we're looking at some of the 2D shapes and 3D shapes resources available on the Twinkle website. So let's get started. Twinkle have a huge selection of 2D and 3D shape resources. These engaging resources are great to use in school or at home. Let's start with the Key Stage 2 2D and 3D shape poster. This resource, aimed at children in Key Stage 2, provides an informative and visual way for children to see which 2D and 3D shapes they are expected to learn in years 3, 4, 5 and 6. With pictures of the shapes displaying their mathematical name, this resource can be used both as a display poster and also as a work mat. When learning the 3D shapes, this interactive quiz is a great way to see your child's knowledge and understanding in a fun way for them. Your children can complete the quiz in the classroom and at home as part of your learning all about shapes. The quiz features a variety of different multiple choice questions. Your children will be tasked with naming a range of 3D shapes and counting vertices and faces. Making a welcome addition to your lesson, this 3D shape quiz can assist you in developing and reinforcing your children's understanding of shapes. Why not use this at the start and at the end of your topic to see how much your child has obtained throughout. The 2D Shape Draw Worksheet contains instructions to draw shapes that match the description in the boxes. Pupils can draw the said shape with the given requirements in the shape provided. An extension for this task is to challenge your children to think about how many different ways that they can draw each of the shapes asked. And if the weather is fine, then let's take it outside with this fantastic worksheet. This can be a fun way to take your maths lessons outside. These worksheets provided some outdoor activities to estimate the area of irregular shapes. Encourage your children to practice estimating an area and then using approximation by drawing a rectangle and measuring it to find the area. On a smaller scale, they can collect leaves and other items outside and use squared paper to estimate the area and then draw around them to see the area of their object. Finally, the Cooperative Game Shapes activity is a fantastic way to end your maths lesson on shapes. Not only is this based around shapes, this is a great speaking and listening task. Children take it in turns to give their teammates clear instructions to produce shapes with string. This task focuses on resilience, teamwork and communication a great way to encourage your children with learning about shapes. As you can see, Twinkle have a wide selection of 2D and 3D shape resources ranging across Key Stage 2. Whatever you need, there's sure to be something on the website for you. So I hope you've enjoyed this video and you can use some of these resources in your next shape lesson. See you next time.